stinks, it stinks, it stinks. My cat farted. Yes, Mr. Sherman, everything stinks. Anyway, just saying random things while I wait for this to load. Previously on Star Fox Adventures, we got to Ice Mountain, and then the Warp Stone... Well, they tried to send us to Ice Mountain, but he missed and sent us to the title screen instead. Fortunately, there is an easy way to get there still. Do that. This is exactly where he would have sent us, so... Nothing is really missed. Nice abrupt cutscene change there. Someone asked if Tricky would be able to figure out how to get here. I think he can make it here just fine. There he is. He got a ride. It's all good. Opened and closed. What is this remote control technology? I've never seen it before. Even though I fly a spaceship. One thing I notice in this prototype is they like to put a space after the periods. And often there's only two instead of three. So, this looks pretty much the same as the final game. Take the barrel, blow up the box with it. Take the barrel again. Whoa, look out. You can do this in the final game, by the way. I didn't think you could, but yeah, it works. You don't need to plant a bomb there, you can just do that. Pretty sure we've already done that. And another cheat token well that doesn't actually do anything. So we go here and beat up on these guys because they're here. So nice of them to only attack me one at a time. I mean, it's only fair. Oh, gotta stop and look at this thing. What was that symbol crash? That was another one, but I didn't make a sound effect and it looked a bit strange. Oh well. These boxes don't have that emblem in the final game, do they? It looks a little, uh, yikes. You can see why they changed it. Looks a little too, uh, 1940s German for my tastes. Here we can actually see what he's saying. Doesn't just say dino. Hey, scale face. Pick on someone your own size. Niak. Nitschkiak. I am Fox McCloud, lead pilot of the Star Fox team. I've come to take the prince back to his home. Stop him, he's getting away. Hey, wait! There's a fuel cell back there.
So this works the same as the final game. We just drive. Oh, we've got some debug text. That's fun. The bombs make a beeping sound. I'm not sure if... I think they do that in the final, but they're a lot quieter, so it's not really noticeable. Yeehaw. Hi, guy. Die, guy. Why? Well, I wasn't even trying to do that. That guy just blew himself up on me on his own. He's just a really crappy driver. soccer ball and bomb. What was that? Something flew in front of the screen. There's the exit to a tunnel that I don't think you can actually enter. It's not just the other path they didn't take there. It's another one that only these guys can use somehow. Whoa, I am buried in snow. And then suddenly the sky completely changes color. We do an extreme slow motion fall. Somehow both of these guys are okay. Damn right. I can't understand you. Spring, or you'd be frozen by now. Why, you little... Hey, I wouldn't if I were you. My dad's a King Earthwalker, and he'll bash you up. Right. There was more of a pause in that statement. Any bashing. He's been captured. And that one. That's why I've been sent to rescue you. He's been captured? That's right. It was your mother that sent me to find you. Is she okay? This dialogue seems a little faster. You'll be just fine. But we need to get you home. Now, the demo is programmed to reset at this point, but I bypassed that. But it is very likely to crash anyway, because this area is very unstable. And you'll see plenty of bugs. These blue mushrooms are an Earthwalker's favorite food. Problem is, they're real hard to catch. If you could grab one hmm. box, I'm feeling real hungry. He doesn't even have a voice clip for that in the final game, but his text does rap correctly, so that's something. Come here, you stupid mushroom. You don't say. How can they be outrunning me? They're freaking mushrooms. Alright, you asked for it, buddy. Mushroom flambe. I hear you saying you're hungry in the background there. Way to go, Fox! Now feed it to me by using your object menu. That's not even what the text says. Should probably grab the other one. Wow, I'm good. Look at this, look at that. Look at me, look at you. Wonder if his tail twitches in the scene like it does in the final. That's better. I don't think so. enough to do some work now. See that patch of loose earth? If you tell me to find, I'll dig a hole. Maybe we can uncover some cool stuff. Final, his tail twitches very slightly because of a typo in the code. There's some. There's some. Fine. There sure is some. Well, that's different. I think it looks different anyway. Alright, now let's try not to screw it up this time. Here. Box, I thought we were 
teammates. Yes, that's what I'm doing. What makes you think we're not teammates just because I walked one inch? I thought I told you to stay. Now we're trapped in here, except the door doesn't close for some reason. I think floating this uh, ice mountains pile actually resets some of our progress, which is why we don't have any bomb spores. But it's the only way forward. I can dig a hole. I activated it by accident. That was pretty cool. Yeah, you can dig holes and tunnels. It's quite a uh, thing. And then he can stand there. I'm feeling real tired. Well, eating isn't going to make you less tired. But maybe it'll fix this stretched out texture. Stop digging in the trash can. Alrighty. Trick is gonna run off. Cat. You're gonna get me killed, you got Tricky ran off, but let's just fly instead. Actually got stuck a little bit there. So that's neat. Frozen egg. Frozen in the air. That's also why we have uh, some of the explanation messages popping up again. Because this is technically a new save file. Nice rendering glitch on the fire there. I guess it's not really a glitch, just looks funny. Slippy has an int text for this too. Hi, Fox. Oh no, he doesn't. Come Never mind. When you need me. He's supposed to. This is camera angle. <laughs> Smashy, smashy. Making a lot of save states here because this area has crashed for me several times. Let's gather up the shrooms while they're asleep. Tricky can wait. I'm sure he's fine. Wherever he is, there he is. Alright, dude. Stop chasing that dinosaur around and take your dinner. By which I mean death. I don't know why I called it dinner, but that was pretty weird looking. And now the audio is glitched. The guy just went behind the ice. And this is different dialogue. And some glitching. Probably about to crash. 
Oh, good. Your text keeps going here. Some of this graphical glitching is something to do with Dolphin's Gecko code support. I pressed A, what do you want? But, uh, also this area is unstable. We. It's probably a good time to make a real save. Yeah, this isn't looking right. Anyway, what's this guy got to say? I'm too hungry to talk to strangers. Makes sense. I don't think he had a voice clip in the final game. My controller is vibrating rapidly here, so let's dig. Fine. Uh, dig. Fine. Oh, he's hungry. Usually he would say that, but in this case he doesn't. Fine. Dum -dum. I got that clip in. That's important. Yeah. Oh, this is different. It's yellow and it's not in the usual place. Texture glitch. Nice sound effect. This is a magic hoe. Um, there's supposed to be more text there. So I guess at one point, your magic was a set number of gems instead of just a generic energy meter. Still seems interested in something here. Fine. Is it just glitched or what? I wasn't trying to hit him. Oh, he's just interested in the food. Yeah, let's look at the thing that I just found. Fine. This one actually has a root growing out of it. I'm not sure if that's supposed to be visible yet, but. the store? There's actually a random NPC dialogue. It, it is random. It chooses a different one each time you talk to them. And it says something about the Warpstone shop. And if you look at some of the unused leftover text, it actually says that he once led you to the shop instead of the maze. I guess the shop just got moved to its own little spot. Oh, cool. I didn't need that anyway. There it is. I don't really need those right now, but there's something else. Maybe 
So, because this guy's asleep now. Which means we get to sit around and wait. Cool. This is a good game mechanic. Guess I'll go hunt. What was that? Green spark. It's like an A button exploded. Eggs don't move or anything at all. Dum de dum. Just gonna glitch the walking animation a little bit. Cause, uh, yeah, I guess all we can do is wait around until the sun rises. Climbing wall texture is different. It doesn't look nearly as climbable. I'll take that. It doesn't count up either. It just immediately goes to the number. Random spots in the snow where the things used to be. It's over here. Wake up, damn it. Did that actually work? No. He opens his eyes, but then he goes right back to sleep. Pretty sure this could still happen in the final game, too. But, snipe people from here. You can just look at all the graphical glitches going on. Huh? That is some very solid water. What the hell are you growling at? Fake tree. Oh, froze. All right then. That's what he was growling at. There was a missing no hiding in the tree. Finally awake. Trying to cross the border. We're I wait, what? Half a box. Just what I always wanted. Uh huh. Sure can. jump when I grab onto it. Let's push it over here. Where do you think we're going, dude? Tricky is not very observant. 
Yoink. No sound effect, but oh well. We don't need no stinking sound effect. Get out of my way, Tricky. Stop climbing the block, Fox. Stop jumping off the block, Fox. He's interested in now. Food? Another crash? Oh, he wants to play, of course. This looks like a good time to play. I'm not busy pulling a block with no reflection or anything. Yeah, you said that already. Yes, he used to be even worse about that. Sit there. Let's get out of this place before it crashes again. Good sign. That reminds me. Oh! Oh, there's the text up there. There you go. It says, uh, something isn't in end waste. Some text ID. But that reminds me. Uh-oh, I don't have my PDA. That's not supposed to be possible, but I guess we're not using it. Maybe I'm supposed to buy it. That is a thing in the final game, but it can never happen because you never lose it. I stuck on here. Also, how many scarabs did that bag hold? Was it 50? Good rap text there, Slippy. What exactly did I grab onto? Hi. Leave me alone. I do not feel like talking. Fine. You that way. down. I don't have the flame command yet. And that won't work, but it does produce a nice, uh, rainbow cube. What's near? Is there something near? It doesn't look like there's something near. I think you're full of crap, Tricky. I like how the snowflakes move up when I jump. Guess they're just kind of stuck on the screen somehow. Is that jump really necessary? Beyond the hollow lies the prince's homelands. Interesting. How is this already dug up? This rock is actually harder to lift. You have to mash A for a lot longer. Is that secret tunnel still there? There it is. And if I teleport around a little bit, I can go inside. And the game can slow way down. And it can snow inside the tunnel. Because that's how snow works. Oh, tricky. Hey! The fuel cell is glitched! I got both of them up there, but both of them are still here. What is the snow doing? It's dripping on me. Something's glitched, but it's not the fuel cell this time. Um... Am I trapped? 
In the final game, this is a wooden barrier. I suspect... Oh, there isn't. I suspect you could have him uh, melt this. Glitch snow effect is just gonna stay that way, I guess. Nice flying grass. You know what? I bet he's trying to say he's hungry, but he's pulling up the wrong voice clip. you come from? I'm trying to get a closer look at this egg and... Oh, okay. I guess you're down there now. But huh? now he's back. Thanks to you, I collected the egg that I was trying to look at. Yeah, jerk. Quit glitching up my camera, you jerk. the button prompt. Um? Okay. This event isn't supposed to happen right now, is it? And, uh, there's probably supposed to be dialogue, and the glitch snow makes it look like Fox is just peeing. So that's fun. It's probably supposed to be music, too, and, uh, somebody owning that shadow, but, eh. <laughs> Pressing find, Fox isn't saying anything, but Tricky just knows. He's psychic. Where did he take it? What are these guys doing here, beating up on this dude? Am I supposed to be stopping them? At some point, that meter went up. I don't know if it's because I'm beating up on these guys, or because the weed made its way over here. Will you stop being invincible for a minute and let me kill you, you jerk? final game, those guys just spawn endlessly, so you're not really supposed to bother with them. Or they don't spawn endlessly and the game bugs, and you figure... you can't figure out why you can't win. Because he stops accepting the weeds. That's fun. Especially when it happens on your first playthrough. You're like, what am I doing wrong? And it turns out, oh, I'm not doing anything wrong, the game is. I think the meter went up a little more there. I'm not sure if these guys are gonna, like, block or destroy the weeds. Oh, there's two of them now. Combat camera, activated. Can I push the weed myself? Well, tricky. Buggers off over there and take a leak or whatever he's doing. So yeah, they do destroy the weeds. That effect makes the magic meter glow, but doesn't actually consume any magic. That's interesting. I notice in the final game, the magic meter glows slightly when you do that, but in this one, it took up the whole meter. And yet, no magic was actually used. Or maybe a very tiny amount. These guys are a lot more aggressive in this version. In the final, they barely bother you at all. Stop destroying that weed. That was on you, Tricky. Stop pushing me! I 
I will say Tricky is a lot better at pushing the weed back over there in this version. He even phased right through the tree there to do it. So I can probably just stay here and keep hitting the tree and hitting Y and even though it's not playing the sound, Tricky will accept my fine command and go get the weed eventually. Then I just stop these guys from destroying the weeds. I don't know how he's pushing that exactly, but don't ask questions. There we go. There was apparently a weed right there at the bottom of the tree somehow. There's three of them rolling around now. Can you guys drop some health, please? I'm starting to get a little beat up. Smash Y. Oh, these guys are hitting weeds out of the tree. That's funny. And they're just kind of magnetically attracted up there. Just hope they're not going to run out of memory because of that or something. And, uh, am I crazy, or was Tricky's food meter at two and a half before, and now it's at three? And now it's back to two and a half. I didn't feed him. Now it's down to two. What, what are you doing, Tricky? You can't make up your mind. Are you hungry or not? Oh, yeah, magic. That's what I needed. Maybe it's supposed to be a hint that I should be using magic, but... Oh, it froze. And that put us way back here. Great. So... Can we actually go back to the hollow now? There's a tunnel here that was here before. Fine. Oh, I have to feed him again. Fine. No, not fine. Where the hell are you? Wake up! There. Because I think we're not actually supposed to do that just yet. That looked odd. I don't crawl through this either, I walk through this. This tunnel doesn't exist in the final game. This is all this is new, I've never seen it before. It looks like the magic cave, but different. But there's just nothing. There's another uh, passageway. Is this how we get back to the hollow? Is this where I came in? I'm just gonna slip, slip my head through. Just push my head right through the snow like in the cartoon. Yeah, I guess this is how you get back. There's no bribe claw. You just run through. Water current is very strong. Slightly different, got different textures. There doesn't appear to be any items up there. The camera really wants to focus up there. There's a missing texture when I splash. The water current is actually going the wrong way. I actually need to switch it back now. Seems like I can swim against it either way. Dum de dum. Oh, was there a thing in the middle? Eh, too late. This area is a little different. 
little more, uh, almost mechanical. Square. What? Okay. I think this is a glitch caused by using the chapter select on the menu. And that's quite the reflection thing going on there. I think because I selected Ice Mountain from the title screen, it uh, loaded in this save file that apparently has never actually landed here. So when I got here, it did that. Because, of course. Well, let's go back there and see if anything happens, because isn't there supposed to be a cutscene when they come in? Come to think of it, I didn't get to open the gate. I am going to have to go through all of that again to get back here. And I can't, because the warp stone won't send me to Ice Mountain. So, yeah, nice. Oh, at least the trick, the cutscene triggers. Camera. Oh, I agree. Is that text just gonna stay there now? Oh, yes, it is. It's it just just stuck on the screen now. That's pretty fun. These are maxed out, even though it doesn't show as color like it usually does. Oh, it went away. That was an extremely long bone. Insert lewd joke here. Whatever. Um, something's missing. Tricky looks confused too. Oh, maybe he's just dumb de dumb. There's a window. That's not normal. I can't go to it either, it's an invisible wall. Pretty sure someone's supposed to be here. Someone pretty important. Hi, Fox. Oops. What do I gotta go back and do that? I sequence breaks by choosing this file. I guess that's part of why it would normally reset after the end of Ice Mountain there. Hey, what's here? Find. Maybe the queen is in here. <laughs> oh, it's a boomadoo. No explanation. Anybody really need an explanation? Where are we going? We're going shopping. It wasn't much of a slide. Welcome to my store. Feel free yeah, to look at the many wonderful items within these walls. I have food. Special goods and many maps. And if you like to play games, then enter the Scarab Room. Don't mind the noise. Oh, and that's the exit. Uh, yeah, don't okay. say. Thanks. Now, if you find something that you like, then choose that item and we'll discuss a prize. Is that clear? Well... Good! Now, hurry and choose something, or get out! This is clearly by, based off the elephant theme song from Diddy Kong Racing. Hey, since I saw that landing scene, do I have the PDA now? I do! Hey! So, 
Let's do this again. You pay this much. Okay, hey, I'll they suggested it. the correct price this time. I still have a tricky food meter here. Warpstone, posture, yes, loves to eat. Usually the, f the food meter doesn't show up in areas where Tricky isn't, and Tricky can't get in here. Pay this much. Sure. No, that's too low. Then don't suggest it, dummy. Gotta scroll all the way up to the actual price, which... Okay, I'll sell it to you. ...was twice that much, but okay. Whatever. It wouldn't let me go past 14. Yeah, the warp stone. Maybe that means I can buy this for a lot less than it says, too. You pay this much. No, that's too low. Make up your damn mind. No, oh. that's... Well, that's all I have. Put that down! You don't have... Scabs. Don't you want to haggle? You pay this much. No, that's too low. You're kind of dumb, you know that. Okay, I'll sell it to you. Clipping glitch. Again with the apostrophe S. Yes. Hurry and choose something. Oh, get out. Fox is just stunned. How are you floating? You have no legs. That item we can't buy yet. Well, it doesn't do anything. No cheating in this version. Even though the cheats in the final version are not cheats at all. Yes, having all the text translated into a alien language is certainly cheating. Is the queen back from vacation yet? I don't know. Water looks more opaque than usual. Oh, I haven't blown this up either. Pretty sure I had, but you know. Again, massive explosions. Hmm, I suppose I could go in there, couldn't I? Tricky, what are you doing? That is quite the camera angle. I'm gonna go give the warp stone his present first and see if that gets the sequence back Wait to where it's me. supposed to be. And if not, then I should be able to go into the well. Well, I guess I can't do this because... reasons. But it just doesn't let me plant it here. Okay, warpstone it is. I mean, well it is. I can words. Something here. 
That was weird. The screen just went blank. What are we going to actually see down there? Speak up! Got no dialogue and no subtitles. In the final game, the camera is stuck in a fixed perspective here. You can't look around. Here, it's, it's not letting me go into first person view, but the camera does move. It seems like a lot more of these mushrooms than normal. But they don't seem very active. I think the water might be deeper here. I can plant a bomb in this one. Oops. See, because this one's red. Oh, yeah, of course. I had no idea what that was. The other one was black, which probably means the soil is no good for plants. What was that camera, though? Where did the water go? Why did it drain away? What's the cutscene there? This one's green. But there's no crystals around the side. Why did you say Veet? What is this music? Why is he pulling his eyes? Extra rocket power. Do you mean to say it has rocket power already? All this time I've had a rocket in my pocket? There's just nothing here. Some funky coloring in the cave, but... Something isn't loaded correctly. Something large. What the hell is this? The PDA doesn't know either. I guess it's a bomb, considering the picture on it. That's not normally there. Thorntail store? Excuse me? I don't think that's correct. But I think I see what's going on here. These two maps, the well and the store, are right next to each other. So I think they are actually too close together in this version, and it's trying to load in the other. That's pretty silly. That looks like you could just run in there. So these rainbows that are appearing are probably supposed to be assets from the store that aren't looted, because... We've just kind of somehow walked into what is technically part of the store, even though we're not there. And it hasn't actually loaded those in. I should look to that. These mushrooms aren't as aggressive. You have to get pretty close to them before they spit at you. numbers doing? 12, 19. They don't change back and forth. Which... So this makes it a little hard to see what I'm doing. But I guess I'm supposed to go this way. I don't have a bomb. I can get one. Those guys are also less aggressive. Here, bomb, bomb, bomb. Really? What was that? That one too. Come on, give me one. Yeesh. That was very dumb. Pretty sure map 12 is the store, so yeah. Quite funny. Yeah, 
Yeah, that is definitely not the same bomb barrel icon model. Good camera there. Is that supposed to do something? I don't think that uh, bomb barrel texture is in the final game. And what's also funny is the final version does appear in this game as well. I saw that in Ice Mountain. So there's just two different versions. What the? That's not how that's supposed to work. Interesting. I don't think I have it quite in the right spot. Nope, it's just glitched. Cool. So that block doesn't work. Whoa, that literally lights up from the staff. Oh, those tentacle guys. Yeah, that's different, too. Well, let's see if I can just run for it. Well, not if it's going to start me facing the wrong way. Hmm. This is a problem. ain't fast enough. Seems like we're a bit stuck. Unless there's anything we can do with the staff booster now. Or maybe it'll let us plant the bomb outside the warp storm now. This platform is a little bit different and I can't climb up. Oh, there he goes. It looks like I may have to create a free movement hack for this version to be able to actually get through the game correctly. Because some things just don't seem to want to work. I was saying, the maps are right next to each other, and this game does have a system where you can just walk from one map into another, which technically I'm doing when I enter this cave, even. You can see the numbers up there next to the LD. Oh, they're not changing. Maybe that's the problem. Now it's raining indoors. Maybe that's why none of the assets in here are showing up. seemed like there was some seam there where I was crossing into what it thought was the shop. Well, how about this? Can I fly somewhere? Did, did, did that R wing have no bottom? Tricky's foot clipping. That fox is still there, at the bottom. Fox, your R-Wing just left without you. Oh, I can't go anywhere else. Maybe if I actually fly through this course, though, it will actually function properly after that. The other thing I could try would be to open that gateway to uh, Cape Claw and Lightfoot Village. That bomb totally missed. Oh no, I missed a gold ring. Good thing Slippy didn't notice. map 
minus one and a minus one. Hmm. That's pretty odd. Oh, and now I'm Fox instead of Fax, so yeah. That confirms when I selected that at the beginning, it just replaced my save file with a different one, which is all mucked up. That might be why the queen's missing. And why the rain is frozen in midair. And the ground is becoming reflective. Where are we going? I have no idea. Probably gonna stop pretty soon, but... So perhaps to actually play through the game correctly, I'm going to have to figure out how to get the warp stone to send me to Ice Mountain instead of to the title screen. Queen is still missing. So there's one more thing we can try. And that's digging this hole. No. We'll do that anyway. Fine. That's another one of these dudes. Wait, I just picked it up. How many do I have now? Two? General Pepper here! Uh, General Pepper here! I'll display your current mission status! So I have two of these guys, even though I can only hold one. And six out of five scarabs. Interesting. Especially given that there is no five scarab. What is the rain doing? I suppose that actually says 50 and the digits are just getting cut off somehow. Can't, I don't have a bomb to put there, but... One more thing we can try doing, and that is opening this. Kind of impressive. You can actually, in the final game, pick up the staff and immediately go open this gate and just run off to here. You can't get very far, but if you do that and then come back later, it will remember where you were in the tutorial, how many bad guys you killed and everything. Fine. You can start the staff combat tutorial, kill one of the bad guys, leave, go through the gate, go all the way up to the gateway to Cape Claw, Come back, and that bad guy is still dead, and there's nothing in this hole. Oh, yes there is. Was that another one of these dudes? Yes it was. I now have three out of one. Slow climbing mixed with lag is a great combination. I'm not sure we can play at this rate. You might just cease to exist if I try to play with you. This looks like this in the final game too, but it looks like there should be a warp there, because of the sparkle effect. But there isn't. Oh, what's this? Can I use it? Disabled for some reason. Got 
shut-ups to end the Cape Claw! 60. I, I refuse to pay that. You Especially because I don't have that many. Go away. That voice is different. Anyway, I don't remember how exactly we opened Lakefoot Village and we're just beating these guys up. Or did we have to get taken in there by being captured? In any case, we're definitely sequence breaking. What's this music? I don't remember this music. Check if that music is still in the final game. There are a couple of unused songs in it. Also, did it just not let me do that because I didn't have enough magic power? No, it's not even doing the button icon. It's not blowing. But, hold on. Well, I can't do it while I'm swimming, I guess. Can't go into first person view. There's a switch up there. That's odd. And you can see it in front of the water. What did that do? There's quite a bit up there. Yeah, you can hit the three trees. That's to get back in after you've already left, though. Don't do that the first time. You get it. I guess it's worth a try anyway. There's a switch there. Again, I don't know what that do. What that do? I don't know what that do. I don't know how to speak English. And I don't know what enables that. Yeah, this area is quite a bit different. Looks like a platform would come out of there, probably if I hit the switch. It's supposed to do that, and then you can get to there, and... I don't know what benefit there is to being over there, but... I'm gonna look around again, because I hit a switch on the other side, too. Which got unpressed. This tree. Tricky is very panting. Very panting indeed. That is correct English. Yes. Well, I went the wrong way. But let's try going into Lightfoot Village. the order. 
this one. And this one. If this guy will get out of my way. Do you mind, dude? Do you mind, dude? Oh, I guess I can't hit the tree. Oh, there we go. Was that the right order, or did I have it back? I think I had it back. Hey, he hit it. Did that do it? Pretty sure that's the right order. One of those two. But nothing happens. Let me in! I hit the tree. What more do you want? I'm not supposed to shoot them, am I? There's targets. Looks like that works too. Either the order's changed or just won't let me do it yet. That's all for today. Next time we're gonna have to figure out some ways to work around the brokenness. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to eat the like and subscribe buttons and 